Hi, my name is Bronwyn Hughes, or Bron for short. I'm from Girl Guides Australia and I'm nominating for the Asia Pacific Regional Committee. Having started as a brownie at seven years of age, I've been a girl guide for the majority of my life, whether as a youth member, an adult volunteer, or as a staff member. For me, a lot of what I've been able to achieve in my life, both personally and professionally, has been because of the teamwork, communication, and the leadership skills that I learnt as a girl guide. I see the opportunity to be a part of the regional committee as a chance to give back to the organisation from which I've gained so much. My first guiding international experience was as a volunteer for our Cabana and it really opened my eyes to the work of WAGS and the difference the organisation makes in the lives and communities of girls and young women worldwide. For me, my passion for the movement and my appreciation of the strength and diversity of girl guiding in the Asia Pacific has only grown through my role as SAMS program coordinator in getting to work with girl guides and girl scouts from across the region and through a project visit for GOLD for Girl Guides Association of Tonga. As a young woman turning 30 in May of this year, I believe I can bring a valuable youth perspective to the committee. Leadership is for everyone, and particularly as the world's leading organisation for girls and young women, it's super important that we have a youth voice at all levels of the organisation. Having recently attended the JLS Facilitators Training in Uganda, I'm aware of the new WAGS leadership model. And if I was elected, I would hope to support the region, but also member organisations in developing leadership capacity at all levels and encouraging more girls and young women to take on big leadership roles. I believe I have a lot of relevant skills I can bring to the committee to help the Asia Pacific region to grow and develop for the future. I'm a passionate advocate of WAGS and have represented the movement at COP 16, 17 and 18, conducting advocacy and lobbying at the UN Climate Change Conferences. It would be a privilege to be able to continue to use my voice to represent and support the Asia Pacific region. Outside of Girl Guides, I work for Australian Red Cross in managing 15,000 volunteers across the country and working to build the organisation's capacity to develop meaningful, relevant and accessible volunteer experiences. I have experience in strategic thinking and have also worked as my state guiding organisation's diversity and inclusion officer. It would be a great honour to be able to use these skills to support the Asia Pacific region to provide more opportunities for more girls of all backgrounds to be able to experience the fun, international friendship and skills development that guiding provides.